Hello, everybody, and welcome to another stream of a Persona 5. I am Gina, aka the Genie 2. My camera is still kind of messed up. I don't know. I don't care anymore. I am in some pajamas. I just got out of the shower. It is one of those nights where we are just chilling and hanging out. Nothing fancy, no makeup, no fancy clothes. It is one of those nights. It's a Tuesday. I hope your guys' day has been wonderful. Hi, Coins. How are you? Uh, and I'm excited to get back into uh, some Persona 5. So when we last left off, we had just uh, stolen Madarame's treasure and hopefully changed his heart. Um, we shall see. Um... And we added Yusuke to the team officially, which I think is pretty great. Because uh, I'm really enjoying him so far. And I'm really excited to see who our next target is. I assume we're going to be adding more people to the party. I'm excited to think of who it may be. Uh, is it going to be somebody we already know? Are we? Is, you know, Mishima going to be punching things with us? You know, um, I don't know. I don't know. Who else? Who else? Who? Who could be joining us? I don't know. Could it be that reporter lady that hit us up? Maybe the student council girl? I don't know. We'll have to see. Give him my game, bitch. I'm excited to jump back in. I'm having so much fun playing this game. It is unbelievable. Very fun. Okay, all we have left to do is go to sleep, and then uh, we have a bunch of stuff to do tomorrow. But for now, what we have to do is go to bed. Well then. Yes. Tonight we can have a nice sleep. Congratulate ourselves on the job well done. Except, oh, now we're in the Velveeta room again. I assume he's going to be hitting us up after we change people's hearts, like every time we change someone's heart. You have expelled one who was stained in vanity. Mm -hmm. You are now one step closer to your rehabilitation. It's a delightful thing indeed. What are we rehabilitating for, Bum? Our master is pleased. I still want to know. You should be honored, inmate. See, Justine has, like the general attitude of Caroline, because, like, that's something Caroline would say, right? You should be honored, inmate. But at least she says it in, like, a calmer and more respectful way. Like, Caroline just gets in our face. However, that man's remarks are concerning. It seems another has made their way into the Ooh, metaverse. okay, so you heard that, too. Yeah, um, wow. Who the fuck is in here? Who could it be? I have no that idea. That is beyond my knowledge. But your rehabilitation is progressing smoothly. That is for certain. Okay. May the devotion to your rehabilitation grow even deeper. I have high hopes of you. And we're getting another level of the Fool Arcana. All right. This is a straight level up. Why does he exist canonically? What is his purpose? So, I was, I've been watching a video series um, that like dives super deep into all of the Persona games. I'm still on the first Persona game because um, it was the first one and there's a lot of shit to it. It's Kitagawa. Hey, Yusuke. Uh, let me finish my thought and then we'll chat. Um, and there are three people okay so technically the velvet room or whatever world it's in is run by this guy named philemon 
um, who I'm pretty sure, you, I know you see him in Persona 1, I think you see him in Persona 2, but he hasn't appeared in any other Persona games, really, since then. Um, he's represented by butterflies, so he kind of has a background presence when you see butterflies and stuff. Um, but he has three attendants that he keeps in his room, uh, that he keeps in the velvet room. Igor is, like, the main attendant, and then there is a guy named Nameless who plays the piano, and then there is a woman named Belladonna who sings the song that you hear when you're in the velvet room. Uh, in the first game, you actually get to walk into the room and see Nameless and Belladonna there playing the music while Igor chats with you. Um... Philemon Puzz Pub of Persona 2. He is very pretty. He's got long black hair and a ponytail and he wears a mask. Um, I don't know if you ever see behind it, but um, I would imagine he is very pretty. But yeah, um, so yeah, they, they kind of, I guess, work for him. Um, and it seems like Igor is kind of the face of the Velvet Room. At least that's what it seems like to me when Philemon is not you know, there, which, again, we, I haven't seen him since Persona 2. I don't think he shows up after that, at least as far as we know. Maybe we'll see him again one day. Calling about state. Maybe we'll see him here, I don't know. Being, he hasn't suffered a mental shutdown. That's good. Other than that, his demeanor seems to have softened a bit. Is that the change of heart? I don't know. It could be. I see. Is it... Also, hi, Plantress. <laughs> I'm sorry if I didn't say hi to you. I was just looking and I was just like, yes! Thank you. Confirmation, he does show up. So yeah, I guess that's kind of his purpose. He's kind of the mouthpiece, I guess. For the Velveeta Room. You could probably Google him and read a lot of lore on him. Well. It's as if he was an entirely different person. Philemon isn't seen personally because of plot in Persona 2 Eternal Damnation. Okay, there's plot reasons. Velvet, now the, I call it the Velveeta Room. So, the reason why I call it the Velveeta Room is uh, in my old D&D campaign, Two and a Half Elves, we had a, um, a drow archer that was part of our party, and her name was Velvet. And so we always called her Velveeta, and then by the end of the game, we just called her Shells and Cheese. Because it just kind of grew, so I just, whenever I hear Velvet Room, I think of Velvet, and I call it Velveeta. <laughs> Will the same be true for Sensei? Well, I'm sorry to have taken your time. That's all I wanted to tell you. Good. Is he still living with him, by the way? Oh, I guess so, he has nowhere else to go. about the black-masked intruder from the palace when the time is right. Okay. Goodbye, then. This time for sure. Velveeta is a mediocre mac and cheese. No, give me some fucking craft or give me death, baby. Hey! I agree. We had a, I had a lot of Velveeta growing up, though, because it is cheap from what I remember. Craft is too, but um, I, ha I had a lot of Velveeta growing up, but I love me some craft. Give me some some craft dinner, as the Canadians call it, any day. Alright, we are going to finish the gallant rogue here today. Hmm? Striking a pose in defiance with tobacco pipe in hand, like a JoJo pose. He truly looks like a great thief. Wow. He was a thief that year. He was a fear of the common people, indeed. Oh. Yes, we did. Ooh, a better understanding of the thief's courage. Ooh, yes, queen. Give me that guts. All right. Yep. I'm almost at the station. Well, I'm also, um, and we've spoken about this before, and I always kind of clench my butt cheeks when I say it because I know I'm gonna get reamed for it. I'm not really a fan of <sighs> cheese. I don't like cheese. <laughs> so, you know, give, give, give me orange powder packet. I'm good with that. Yeah, I do. I'm not really a big cheese person. The only cheese that I outwardly enjoy is mozzarella. Like, you could give me fresh mozzarella and I could put it on, like, a cracker or something, and I'm good. I could eat that, but, like, every other cheese is garbage. Parmesan is okay sometimes. Sometimes, um... Uh, sometimes ragot is alright if you mix it in with stuff as long as there's not too much of it. Like, ragot inside, like, um, like a ravioli. That's fine. 
Also, stop being a creep I'll to On. Thank you. You're a cat. Please wait till you're in a human body. Thank you. When you break two dollars, you get a high rank on the first exam. I'm surprised the guy. Did uh, I don't think the guy had me get up there because I don't. I don't know if it's. I mean, I suppose it is possible, but with the way it laid everything out, it isn't. It does say though that if you're on New Game Plus, you know, you can easily ace it. I might do a new game plus of this game. I just love this game. It's just, I'm very happy with it. Okay, we are going to return this book and go get another one. So, to the biblioteca, please, and thank you. You're <laughs> ugly on cubes of cheese like a mouse. Yeah, I've, I, I have learned to kind of, sort of, be able to maybe choke down a mild cheddar. Kind of. But anything other than that, I don't- Provolone can be okay if it's on something with a lot of flavor. Like, if you put some provolone on, like, a cheesesteak, that's fine, because there's tons of other flavor in a cheesesteak, so you don't get, like, that pungent, you know, cheese thing going on. But any other cheese than that is just gross and smells like feet. And the worst offender is American cheese. American cheese is garbage, and I literally have to fight to not vomit every time I smell it fucking fight me. American cheese is garbage. And I used to eat it like a fucking rat when I was a kid, too. I used to take, you know, the, you know, individually, you know, wrapped pieces and I would, like, sneak one out of the fridge. I'd be like, no. Gross. Disgusting. I was a terrible person, and I should feel terrible about it. It would be cool. I was... There was a part of me that was hoping that the Vita would stick around long enough for them to make a Persona 5 portable and put it on the Vita. But obviously the Vita's long dead, so... R.I.P. my beautiful Vita. I love you. I appreciate you. Yeah, Scramble is kind of interesting. If I ever get a Switch, I, I would be interested in maybe trying Scramble, but um... I would love to see this- I would love to see this get- the Persona 3 portable treatment. I want a female protagonist. I want new romances. I want new confidants. Give me some new shit. I want to play this game while we're going to get excited about it. We are going to be getting the alluring dancer. Yeah, I'm sure you do find it interesting because you know it's all about Lady An's persona. I don't like Pokemon. I know, I know, I'm Gina Chu, I know, it's very... Okay, so it wants us to go do a strength pers- I have to go make another persona for the strength confidant. I'm very upset about it, but let's do it. Shibuya! Yeah, I do. I don't like Pokemon. I think it is a ridiculous concept. Like, I just, I mean, it's weird saying that playing Persona, but like, I don't know. It's just, it never grabbed me. It never grabbed me. I played Pokemon Blue because all of my friends were playing it. I was like, oh my god, I have to play Pokemon like all the time, oh every day, always, forever, because everybody loves Pokemon. You'd like to, to read like the, the computer cool to register it? And then I decided I didn't give a fuck. Are you sure? So here's my problem. Is it wants me to fuse Done already. Jack Frost and Asperus to get what I need for this thing. Now, Jack Frost is a magician, and I don't have Asperus, but I can buy her. But I need to make sure that I still keep everything I need. So, Slime is still off the table. Barrett is still off the table. Pixie is still off the table. Matador is off the table. And Copa Tengu's off the table. So, I need to get rid of one of those people that is not them, which I think is pretty much just either on Moraki or, or Huapo. Sub in Asperus and merge it with Jack Frost to get this next level of the strength.
Yeah, I agree, Chess. Either you're really into Pokemon or you're not, I feel like. I kind of get the Pokedex thing. I mean, we have a fucking Persona compendium. I would like to see it filled out, too. Like, I kind of want to catch them all. Let's be honest. <laughs> but, like, I can't smush, you know, a Charizard and a fucking, you know, Rattata together and get me a fucking Ponita. Which, by the way, Ponita and Rapidash are the only good Pokemon. Change my fucking mind. Those are my thoughts on Pokemon. I like the fire horses. <laughs> Alright, so Huapo has Augie. She's my only Augie person and she's about to learn more Augie. I can always get her back once I f fuse Jack Frost and but I'm gonna want Jack Frost back too! Alright, we're, we're gonna we're gonna deal I'll with it. I'm gonna save here and we're gonna fuck around and we're gonna see what we can do. So, Igor. Yes. First thing I want to do. You'd like to read the compendium? These are the paths you have walked. I would like an Asperus, please. Is this what you want? You yes. can hold no more personas. Okay, so how do I let one go? Can I do that just are from my finished? regular menu? I probably can. I could probably dismiss it. Yeah, I, I don't like that they released, that they always release like two different versions of Pokemon and then they're like, you have to either buy both or have a friend that has the other so you can swap and get all the Pokemon. Like, don't fuck with me, all right? I'm buying your game. I'm putting the time into it. Give me all the fucking Pokemon, all right? Oh, I can delete it. Okay, well, that, that seems like a harsh thing, but... Bye, Wapo! Ah! Okay, good. You certainly seem composed. Yeah, I get that there's a socialization mechanic, but let's be honest, You'd they like did it for the money. Compendium? And then... I always remember looking from the outside looking in anyway that like one version is always way more popular than the other and then the people who buy the popular one are like I can't find anyone that has the other and then like everybody gets angry it's like it just seems really These dumb. are the paths you have walked. I don't know. Is I feel like I saw want? a lot of you that. Withdraw this persona? Yes. This is your power. Your power is my butt. Okay. Now I would like to create a new Inmate persona. needs our guidance. Let's execute him. Justine's like, he needs our help, and Caroline's like, let's kill some bitches! Fusion. <laughs> Jump off the fucking head! <laughs> well, yeah, I would imagine that there are a number of people that would want to get the less popular version, because then you're going to get more people wanting to play with you, right? Like... It just seems silly. All right. So he wants the. We need to get a Makami with Frey. Not terrible. All right, not that's impressive. it. Choose the inherited skills, inmate. Can I and have him inherit Agi? No. Fuck! Can I make him my Ice Pokemon and not have to bring Jack Frost back? I really like Jack Frost, though. I probably shouldn't do that, honestly. Um, I always like to keep... Is Mothfrey coming? Its power will be nothing unusual. Well, I, if I'm gonna keep Bufu, I want to keep Ma Bufu. Just having Ma Bufu would be a little silly. Well, maybe not. Its power will be nothing unusual. Mm, I'm kind of okay with that, actually.
it's just that, you know, it's gonna be way more of an SP dip if, but, I mean, it would still work as an ice attack, I guess, as long as the other people, you know, as long as there's people who aren't going to absorb it, but, whatever, fuck it, let's my, do it. My. Okay, that was, that sounded, that sounded a little sexual, I'm sorry. He's like, my, my, more heads are gonna roll. Me, Makami, me be your mask and howl at enemies. Yes. I could also just ditch him if I don't want him, to be totally honest. I'm just making him to get the, you know, you know what I mean? I'm just, I, I literally just made him to increase. You change your mind? Done already? the strength arcana. Like, I could really just ditch him. Now. See? Tress knows Ponita. It's the only good uh. Pokemon. Huh? What? I have it. You wanted a Shisa. I'll just add this. That is not. What the walkthrough said. Oh! I'm dumb. I then have to go get Kelpie and merge Kelpie with Makami to. Okay. I missed a step. I'm the dumb one. Do you have business with me? Don't you dare insult the fire horses. Fire horses are great. You'd like to read the read here. Yes, I would like my Kelpie back, please. This persona? You'll withdraw this persona? This is your power. <laughs> Are you finished? Sing it, Belladonna. I'm done. Oh wait, no. I wanted to refuse them. I'm dumb. Huh? I'm dumb. I'm freaking out. I'm having a problem. I'm having a time. Ah. You wish to perform fusion. Makami, Kelpie. You okay with this? Can I so carry Frey over? Like I can. Hand. Okay, great. He has Zeo. It will receive some new power. Yes. My, my. Hey, Schultz, what's up? Jim, Jim Char! Jim Char! You're not gonna get that. You're not gonna get that video reference. It's a video my brother and I love. Jim Char! That's your worst pick yet! <laughs> now nah, I'm not gonna save Daya. Die is starting to get a little outdated. We're getting we're getting into diorama territory. All right. Cool. And now I've got Chisa, who I really don't you want. You change your mind? Are you finished? But I'm just gonna get it, you know, for the memes, and then now. Hmm. It would seem. Yeah, I got. I brought it. <laughs> Actually, I'm kind of glad that I made that other one. Very well. Um, that Makami because it has uh Frey, and was about to get Ma Frey. So like, if Frey ever becomes useful, like, huh. it's nice to have the ability. See, what I used to do in Persona Three and Four is I would try to keep at least one of every kind of elemental ability on me so that I can exploit weaknesses, but there's so many here. Now they have the psychic one, they have Frey, they have um, <coughs> that uh, that fear one. Like, there's so many more of them, you just you can't do it until maybe late game. Uh, I guess you've at least got the will to work. Of course I have the will to work. Don't give me that smug attitude. <sighs> Yet she's smiling. Yeah. Alright, what do you want now? 
Oh god, it's gonna it's gonna get real complicated. <laughs> it's gonna get real complicated, and I'm gonna rage quit at some point, but I might as well keep going for as long as I'm willing to. Alright. I have a matador. Does he have Magaru? Wait a minute. He doesn't. That would have been really funny, though. That also means that if I make another matador, it's gonna override this matador. And I'm gonna have to let this matador go before I make another matador. I might just want to let him go now then. TBH. He's like by far my highest, you know. And I don't really care for Shisa, so like. I'm gonna wind up letting Shisa go. First, let me make sure I don't. I, I don't believe I have to. Oh. You'd like to read the compendium? Okay. Are you finished? I wish you wouldn't keep asking me if I'm if I want to head back. I wish that I could just back out so that I could just do what I need to do. I'm getting a little annoyed by some things. Alright. Alright, so let's see what I got now. I've got Zeo, I've got Garu. That's it. I don't have any ice and I don't have any fire. I want my Jack Frost back. <laughs> Actually, I'm gonna have Yusuke, but you'd like to read the complete here. Still. Is this what you want? Is this what you do want? Do I wanna do I wanna get Hippo back? I kinda want Hippo back. I kind of want to get Hippo. Then accept this persona. I don't even care about the money because the easy mode this lets me just buy whatever. Is required. Then accept this persona. Yeah, I would have to manually override it. You are correct. But, like, I also couldn't summon the one that I have saved if I already have the other one in my inventory. You know what I mean? So I would have to let it go then. Which I could if I, you know, if I preferred the original setup I had, I could, you know. But I would be fine if I could get some fire abilities on a matador and then dump Hua for him. Like, I, I'd, I'd be down. Right. Done already? Yeah, you can, you can, yeah, I'm done. No slacking off. Bye. Oh, wait a minute! Yo! Don't I have something like that? Don't I have a card like that? I'm Medaya. I knew I had some kind of Ma card. I thought it might have been, uh... Magaru, but... It's Medaya. That's fine. I'll deal with it when I get there. I may not even want to bother with it. I don't know. I have enough money in this, e you know, in this easy mode to mess with it. If I were in a harder mode, I would not want to waste a single fucking penny on doing this. So. Okay. So now we're gonna go hang out with Ryuji. Kamashita? Ooh. Got in trouble at school before with this drinking. Oh shit. Yeah. 
We can trade in my place. Listen, it's just a suggestion, my dude. Even as you're playing video games all day long. Do I have a video game system? I get you, though. Whoa! Uh oh. Are you kamashidoing them? Fist. That that is kind of cowardly. Don't go punching people. That should come. She to put us through is his fault. Oh, what? Is, um, you guys should trust him. Shut up! Stop making sense, Ryuji. He sold you out, really. He's gotta be the snitch. Uh oh, now Ryuji's mad. Wow, don't don't go don't go swinging at my boy. It's gonna make you feel better. Go for it, but you're gonna wish you didn't. It feels real bad looking back on shitty stuff you've done. Yeah. <coughs> the bastards cause you guys can just put this crap. Yeah, there really is no reason to fight. Proof. Yamu- Oh yeah, of course Yamauchi said it. That shit like he was a book. Wow. What a dick. Wow, he's trying to defend you, man. What a jerk. That's not true. Fine. Yeah. Hey. Ooh, but uh oh, is Ryuji about to drop some truth bombs? Do it. This will come to you the back of the hanging on to the passing. That's right, you tell him, Ryuji. That's right. Smart boy. Listen, he may not know anything academics wise, but he's got street smarts. <laughs> Hey. Uh, more or less. <laughs> what are you supposed to do? Hmm. Oh, that's very sweet. I don't get it. Huh? <laughs> We're just messing around with them. Check your status ailments! Oh! Give it to me! Daddy! Cure me, daddy! I love it. Let's go! I'm very excited about that. Ah. Uh. You're back. Hey! Oh, yeah, we have to do that paper bag thing with the uh, airsoft guy. Oh, there's the thing we bought 50 bandages. I'm just buying whatever because if I'm gonna be rolling in all this money, this. like, I'll be honest with you, I'm a tad regretful that I picked so easy of a mode. If I picked the hard next hardest one up, I probably would see more of, like, the boss battles and stuff. But I'm not gonna regret the lack of grinding. Because it just makes for such a boring stream, you know what I mean? Alright, we're gonna read the Alluring Dancer tonight. Make sure you close up. Yes, sir.
But she danced all the men fell at her feet. Wow! She looks but her way of life is also very beautiful. Yeah, I'm sure it reminds you of Vaughn. Hey, hey! That's alright, we we got halfway through it. Ooh! Look at our numbers! Who made this site? Ridic! Thieves should be arrested. Oh, we're getting some real stuff. <laughs> Never even heard of them. People are having some real ass opinions. Good morning. Oh, Makoto. Hello. That reminds me. What's the change? Um. I'm, I'm acting the same as usual. I see. This is just my imagination. Then. Anyhow, I wish the culprit would come forward soon. It's absurd to pretend I could do the police's job. I, uh, yeah, I think the I think the principal's a dickhead for asking you to do all of this. What the fuck is his problem, man? Hey. Hey. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> okay, okay. This I actually this I remember. Okay. I remember this. <laughs> oh, just you wait, guys. Just you wait till you see where this is going to go. A cute maid will do anything for you. A maid who will do anything for us. <laughs> Yeah, this is one of those things that I understand why I remember it all these years later. Uh, what are you saying? God. She's not- she's not gonna sleep with you, dude. Some guy on my floor has just went down so there's a vacant apartment in my complex. The key is behind the mailbox so we can get in any time the landlord seriously doesn't- So- Oh, Machinima, do you want in on this? Oh, he does! Yes, he's like, yes. I would like some maid action. No, no. But it's just for research. Do the maids look exactly as they're advertised? We need to determine whether or not this company just pretends to offer a housekeep. He's like, yes, this is hardcore research. Uh, I, I guess we'll have to then. Just get who we need to punish them. Yeah, well, we just want to see if we have to change their heart. That's all. It's definitely fan of thieves' business. <laughs> we just, we just, we just won't invite on. <laughs> Every little detail. Jesus Christ, Ryuji. I don't remember. I I remember the twist in this, but I don't remember exactly how it goes. So, um, fifty bucks says Ryuji. The moment he gets anywhere near having his hands on a woman, just freaks the fuck out. <laughs> you think this is cringe? Wait till we actually call the maid service. <laughs> um, All right. Operation Maid Watch. Beautiful. Oh. He likes it. Oh, I re I remember the twist here. Oh my god, can we call the maid service like right now? Because that would be really funny. Wait, when are we gonna call the maid service? Can you please tell me? I think- are we gonna do it today? I don't know. So, he's been hanging out at Monjayaki shop a lot. He gets real drunk there, breaks his spirit for us. Uh, maybe? He'd probably notice me. So, I'll let you know to figure out when he's going drinking. Okay. Cool. I'll just add this. So, hanging out with me, he's kind of unpaused until he figures out where this guy's getting drunk. 
Joker and getting involved with stupidity. What else is new? Just wait till you see it. I hope we're doing it today. I can't really tell. I think we might be doing it tonight. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we're doing it tonight. I'm looking at like the choices you're supposed to make and I'm pretty sure that's what we're doing like right now. Anyway, we are going to go to the bookstore in Shibuya Central Street and buy a book. I don't have the bookstore on quick travel yet. That's fine. Uh, bookstore, bookstore, bookstore. Oh, it's right behind you, Gina, you moron. What can I get you? We're gonna get the Medjed Menace. On the hacker group, be knowledgeable about internet crimes. Ooh, prime me up, daddy. I don't know why this whole daddy thing is something I just keep repeating. Um, we are now going to go. Uh, not any of those. Um, we are we are gonna go hang out with Takemi actually right now. I'm this. just gonna save here because we can, and I feel like it's been a little while. What up, to Kevin? <sighs> a high school teacher. So relationship between rising temperature and weirdos. Um, I want to do a clinical trial. Yes, I have Matador to help me grow stronger with Takemi. Please head to the exam room. Okay, you can go. Oh, 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 we got a call. Hello? Again. That's, the ship's already sailed, so uh oh. Uh oh, what happened? Remember the girl from the other day, the chief of staff? Uh oh. Her dad's been bringing her here to be treated, even though I referred them to another hospital. I even told them about the medical error I made. Uh, was it really your fault, though? Hmm. The medical error was well documented. Everyone in my field knows about it. I led the development of a new drug for an incurable disease called Crawford Ennis disease. I assume, is that what you're testing us on? Are you still trying to find a cure? Although I wasn't the one who administered the medicine, it was the cause of the error. With Crawford Ennis, certain cells indiscriminately attack other cells throughout the body. When it reaches the muscles, the patient slowly begins to die. Which progress we're not in, partly because there haven't been many cases of it. So the company that reached the final stage of production, was it called Cradle Pharmaceuticals? Because if so, you really shouldn't work with them. I heard they kidnapped children and put them on boats. One day I was suddenly removed from my position. This so team took over the entire operation. <laughs> what if he wanted the glory of developing a new drug to become rich and famous? He made careless mistakes and rushed completion so he could use it on a patient. Let me guess, it didn't end well. <laughs> yeah. What a fucking scumbag. It's not too late. That's fine, I guess. <laughs> the development of the medicine was suspended, so I had no reason to stay at the hospital. Yep, yeah, that's what I figured. She's trying to find an actual cure. Disease, probably. Well, that's good. <laughs> it is creepy that you keep calling me hey. a little guinea pig, though. <laughs> yeah, zero escape reference. What about it? <coughs> yes, give me a discount. Support items. All right. Hmm. I'm scared that doesn't work. 
<laughs> yeah. It's not much of an increase, but it is. Oh, we got a. We're now staunch. We've leveled up. SP Adhesive 3 is now available, but we should not buy it right now. It costs 100,000 yen right now, but later it'll be half price. Well, that's ah, nice to know. You're back. Legal action. Say, so we bought up this legal action goes through. Yeah. The worst cause of the worst. <laughs> said it's some sort of juvenile hall. <coughs> He's been bedridden since we went through with it. Ooh. I'll say, are you going to be okay? Oh my god, we're getting hit up by so many people. Oh! Yes! 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 Also, did the music change again? I'm pretty sure the song that was playing when we go back home had less background music. Like, it it, it didn't have a lot of, uh, like, background instruments at first, and then when we beat Kamashita, it still didn't have a lot of background music, but had the lyrics, and now it has the background instruments with the lyrics. I feel like it changed again. I'll just add this. Alright. Machinima, let's do this. <laughs> Hell yeah! All right. We're going to Ryuji's place. Get ready for this! Ah, oh, here we go! Get ready for this, coins. You think it'll be okay? <laughs> Should made watch, bro. <laughs> well, it doesn't be sketchy, we can just bail. This apartment's Vegas, so it's like we'll be messing with anyone's home. You're a genius, Ryuji. Okay. Oh, <laughs> to think he has a brain. Yeah, we're gonna make you give it to a call. All right, leave it to me. I'll do it. Yeah, a bunch of children. Thank you for calling. It's Victor <laughs> Victoria's housekeeping. Is that like Victoria's secret? <laughs> Listen, I'm doing what I have to do to do what I need to do. All right, I'm just giving the answers I'm hey. supposed to give. <laughs> Service. Is there anyone in particular you'd like to request? Huh? Um. No preference. Let's see. Yeah. Well, 20 minutes. May I ask for your address? Whoa! This is really happening. <coughs> I can't wait to see Coins' reaction to this. Wonder why some of the other services either should we hold a strategy meeting to discuss? They're starting oh. to get nervous, I'm telling you. Ryuji's gonna fucking bail. <laughs> you were in there for a while, did you wash your hands? Yeah, we're, are, we're all nervous. Are high school students even allowed to use this type of service? I don't know! That's a good question. What? You should have researched it. What if they find out who we are? Wait. Yeah, why, why does it matter how old you are if you're calling a housekeeper? Oh, here huh? we go. Here we go. Oh, my bad, man. You handle the rest. And don't let her find out you're a high school student! 
I got you back from way back. Like, yep, and there he goes. What? He's, oh, they're both splitting. Oh my god. Hi, right, here she is. Oh, there you are. Welcome home, Master. Your tired heart, your tired heart, full of lovely energy. I'm Becky, and I have the pleasure of serving you today. Hello. How thoughtless of you. I should explain our services to you. Yeah, they are cowards, but just you wait. We're not done yet. The bases include cooking, cleaning, laundry, but there are other services we provide if you desire. You look young. Are you perhaps in high school? Yes, I am. Well, Master, you're so funny. Wait, that was a joke, right? I'll wait until I'll put put those other services until you've matured a bit. Yeah, I'm a dad. No. <laughs> so I'll be going now. Huh? Uh oh. Oh. Hmm. Have you figured it out yet? Did you request me specifically? What do you mean? It's alright, how would you know me? This is our first time meeting! Yes, the fr- Ah! Coins got it! Coins got it! <laughs> this, I did not forget. Because I remember when I saw the scene, I was like, What the fuck? Oh, this is unbelievable. <laughs> yes, it's me, your homeroom teacher. <laughs> I'm not romancing the teacher. In a propes my goats. Yeah, no. I actually had a friend of mine tell me that he wants to romance Kawakami because um, he feels weird romancing high school students and I was like yeah but you are a high school student I don't feel comfortable being a high school student romancing a teacher no. <clears throat> same reason why I don't feel comfortable romancing the doctor either because she's clearly like an adult when we are a teenager I'm so done I can't believe I got caught by some of my own students Need to be close to so I can- oh, gee, yeah, what kind of salary hey. are they paying you that you have to be a maid in your spare time? Cheer about this phone. Was it Miss Chono? Wasn't it that harpy? <laughs> oh, the English teacher. She's been snooping on all the teachers ever since that incident with Mr. Kamashita. Oh, good. What do you mean? Doesn't seem like you're playing dumb. In, in any case, I'll get in big trouble if you tell on me. Yeah, we have we have some leverage over her now. If you're going to side with the teacher, side with me. I'm in charge of your class after all. Ooh, ooh, anything? Hmm, what to do? She's like, you son of a bitch. <laughs> I imagine it's weird because I would imagine she would not be happy with this arrangement. Hey. You know what I mean? It won't be any better if people find out you called maid service. It's true. This is even your home just- yeah. Yeah, no, this is not our home. So why don't we both forget this ever happened? I'll treat this as if you'd cancel so you won't have to pay anything. Alright, that's fair enough at least. Don't say anything about this in school, okay? Just act as if it never happened. I suddenly <sighs> feel exhausted. <laughs> oh man, good times. Who's spreading this? Try and steal it, asshats. I like seeing the new stuff pop up. Is this some, is this some kind of cult? Yeah. <coughs> some famous in Shibuya yesterday. That parliamentarian from when I was a kid. Oh yeah. Yeah, no good Tora. We're friends with him. 
No one pays him any He used to be a rising star and positive one of the scandal. I'm just kidding. Yeah. In the end. You're pandering to the middle class people. Yeah, that's what he's doing. He's pandering to the middle class. It's not like he's, you know, a human being. Jeez. Sometimes I see people writing exactly the same things on their essays. With copying stuff from the website. Oh no, got it. Yeah, no plagiarism. <clears throat> Moderame. Sir Arthur Conan Doyle has the famous character Sherlock Holmes. Let's have another- uh, yeah. So, IRL, Arthur Conan Doyle is- and his entire estate is a fucking dick when it comes to Sherlock Holmes. You cannot use anything that resembles him. They will come for your ass. There is a game, uh, I think it's in the, uh, the Phoenix Wright series that's in Japan that will never come to America because Sherlock Holmes shows up. And they, it's, you can't. They won't. They won't. They won't let you. What's up? Do you know the answer? <clears throat> the other famous novel that Sherlock Holmes appeared in. Arsene Lupin, gentleman burglar. That would be us. So no. Um, I'm gonna guess the Count of Monte Cristo. Oh no, it is Arsene Lupin, the gentleman burglar. <laughs> Well, that's what I get. Also, is that what Lupin the Third is based off of? Arsene Lupin? Big brain moment? I don't know. <coughs> well done. Oh, no, he's just the personification of my soul. It's fine. <laughs> Huh, a showdown between a thief and a detective, huh? <laughs> kind of like Saye getting in our face and interrogating us? Interesting. <laughs> Herlock Sholmes. <laughs> yeah, that is because it's very relevant to what's going on. Nice going. Can I get a level up at all the knowledge? All right. <coughs> Our Saint Lupin is synonymous with the idea of a phantom thief. Yeah, we're gonna go talk to Kawakami. <laughs> oh, of course it would. Like, uh, 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 sure, Herlock Sholmes is too obvious. There's that bitch teacher. Yeah, this woman's like uh, up everyone's ass, I get. I guess. Uh, so. A series of scandals on this campus will all be called into question. And yet you leave work earlier than anyone and you barely make it to the faculty meetings. Explain yourself! Oh, Jesus. Mm. Or did you need something from Miss Kawakami? Uh, I have a question for her. What? Another question. Uh, that's right, Kurzu's son's questions are complicated so I take time at night to help him! So you're giving individual lessons outside of school hours. What passion! You are the ideal teacher. 
I'm sorry for suspecting you. Wow, she bought it! She just kind of convinced herself. I'm just in front of my night job. Ooh! Call at night and request me. Just be careful that it doesn't show up in your call history. Hey! Alright. Well. <laughs> yeah, maybe she could clean that stupid ass attic we live in. I wonder if we could get her to do our laundry to clean that dirty shit that we found. That would be kind of cool. Alright, we're gonna now hang out with On. I should write something. I shall be in the underground motion video right now. <coughs> I haven't hung out with On for a while, so. Why are we confronting it? Uh, because we were worried about her, because she said she was in some kind of trouble. So said Morgana. We'll just have to wait for now. Um. Yes. Hang out with her. Yes! No Kashira Park. Oh, we unlocked a new place. Sweet. A natural respite. Get away from the stress of city life. Couples often ride in boats in the park. Alright. Came up with a way to do it. You're amazing, on. Um. So that means you don't let anything get under your skin. So basically, I want you to try and stuff. Say stuff to me, and I'll try not to get bit. You want us to insult you? This is this is not going well. This is not going to go well. Um, uh, what kind of stuff? <laughs> I started. I won't let that hesitation shake me. All right. Hit me with your best shot. Okay. Um, you're an airhead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, um, you're a hard worker. Uh-huh. <laughs> what else? Can we stop yet? <laughs> yeah, that means I win. Oh, on. I mean, you're a hard worker isn't even an insult. Huh? <laughs> How is this game supposed to go? No. Yes! Okay. Uh, you're a genius. You know, I kind of feel like this won't make our persona stronger. Um, we finally get it. Hmm. Something's not right. Oh. Agency. The next shoot is. I don't see any pictures into this new place to tell you. Apparently, some models have been. Oh, you model? I did not know that. It's like since she's been really had to go to the scrum and they've had to do for substitutes. Has that happened to you? Yeah. I haven't missed a single shoot so far. Well, good for you. I just have to see a sub show too. Hopefully, it doesn't happen. Oh, she's finished! Well, that explains the blue eyes and blonde hair. Parents didn't have enough models for their event. Um. Parents, well, fashion designers should put on some. Se oh. Well, no. Well, she's well, she's got you know artistic, you know, stuff in her family as well. No wonder why Yusuke was so attracted to her. Country to country, so I only really see them for half of the year, maybe less these days. Uh, the freedom sounds nice. Yeah, it would be tough. Actually, thinking about it, we have you know, we're living 
above Sojiro's place, but at night he's gone. Ryuji's only got the one parrot, and I assume she works. <laughs> An's parents are gone most of the time. Yusuke has nobody but, uh... But, uh, Madarame, who we're now taking care of. We really don't have any caretakers! <laughs> That's interesting. <coughs> well, we're friends now. Yeah. This is like connecting with my parents now. It's a nice hobby to have. Oh, that's how he spotted you, huh? Nobody can be yes. That's right! Nobody can substitute you except Yusuke because we pulled you out of the party! <laughs> Follow-up attacks! Oh yeah! What strikes me is Joker's parents aren't more involved with this process. Why would they agree for him to be transferred far enough away where he has to live with a single coffee shop owner? Because it was the only school they could find that would take a convicted criminal. <laughs> I knew where the main villain was this female thief. She loses to the hero every time, but I always thought she was cool. She wasn't really a good person to say. She was beautiful, strong, sincere, and even sexy. Ooh. She knew what justice was for. <laughs> Bye! Ah, you're back. Hey! I did. I don't know if I I'm going to tell her. However, first we're going to play a quiz show! <coughs> Confessions of crimes are the queen of evidence or the jewel of evidence? Which one is right? Jewel? Queen. I'm batting a thousand here, man. School prodigy for you. To the first of your confessions before. A high school prodigy? Were they interviewing a high school prodigy? Alright. Oh, now we're learned! We finally are not as dumb. Alright, we are calling Kawakami. Hey, teach, get over here and clean my shit! You. Yes, we have to pay for this confidant. I assume it's a confidant. Yes, it's a confidant. I see. We have to carry a temperance persona. Oh, great. <coughs> so, this is your room, huh? Hmm. How do I put this? It's shitty. Uh, never mind. So, what kind of kid are you? The way you opposed Mr. Kamoshida, I'd say that you're earnest and have a strong sense of justice. That being said, you called a maid service and requested me? You told me to. I was really lonely. I see. Oh, that's right. You have a criminal record. Okay. <coughs> How about this? I'll let you skip class a few times. It's tough not having any place where you belong, isn't it? However, I reserve the right to change my mind if your grades drop. And in exchange, you won't tell anyone that I'm moonlighting as a maid. Okay, I see where you're going. Sound good? Fair enough. I promise. My lips then are sealed. Deal. I made a deal with Kawakami. Clearly you couldn't have pulled this off without a teacher. One that moons lights as a maid. Admit it! <laughs> 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 
To think you pulled off so many crimes while attending school. I can't believe you managed that by yourself. There had to be someone at the school helping you. I should have realized that uh, Makoto and Sae were sisters because they have the same eyes. What do you have to say to that? Um, I say I am thou and thou art I. I am thou. Thou art I. It shall become the wings with the birth of the temperance <coughs> or so. Allows you to perform various activities in Kawakami's class. It's called Slack Off! Alright. Oh, cool. We can now use our class time to do things. Ugh, what am I doing here with one of my students? Well, I guess I should get going. Oh, please request me if you need any help with your housework, okay? Yeah, I, if, if, I mean, if she's doing this for the money, then she's gonna definitely want us to keep on calling her. Uh, I don't need any help. That's clearly not true. <laughs> Come on, we know each other's secret, and it would put my mind at ease. Besides, I'm, uh, I'm considered over the hill for this type of job, so I don't get requested that often. Oh. <laughs> yeah, they're like these reddish-brown eyes. Why is my phone exploding? You'd think I was... The main character here with the way I'll my phone is I'll show my appreciation exploded. by making it easy for you to ditch class. Just think about it, okay? Thank you for using our service! Lame Raffle now. Not even worth a laugh. Hello? Oh, Yusuke! Well, we don't go to the same school, so I'm shocked to see you here. When you say, but the exhibit is still going strong. I can't respect him as my sensei anymore, but it's sad to think I don't have- Yeah, that must be hard. Uh, I'm all ears if you need it, buddy. Oh? Oh, use oh ow, Yusuke, ow, no, my heart, ow, no, oh, ow. Friendship, Yusuke, friendship. I should write something. We're getting closer. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna go work at the flower shop. At the underground mall. Yeah, that is really sad, Tress. Yusuke seems like such a decent guy, too. He seems a little awkward, but I bet if he could socialize a little bit, you know, get that out of his system. I'm gonna work here. Cool, we can quick travel to the flower shop now. That's nice. Hello! Is Lucky the owner of the shop? Just observe Next! <coughs> Alrighty. Hey! That apron suits you. Be quiet. so kind because I've learned what it's like to have your soul crushed by working a retail job and so I will never be mean to anyone ever again. That's how it works. Man, 19 pen times were scary. All right. Wanna head back? Well, I take out five jillion jobs because they all have different benefits, baby! Uh, 
Ah, you're back. The emergency is drinking at the Munja restaurant. Okay, yeah, we're gonna go and help him. Let's go. And we've unlocked Tsukishima. Waterfront district famous for its canal, uh, started by canal service, so it's Monjayaki. Tsukishima's famous Monjayaki will hunt you for good old days. I don't right. know what a Monjayaki is. I mean, I know Yaki is like, you know. Ya ya okay, so Yaki it means like a. It's like a, a festival snack. You know, it's like a, a celebratory treat. I know that. The teacher who's with him has shit on me too. I'm gonna be hiding in the bathroom. Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah, let me just hear what they're saying. Dear mother of God in heaven. Uh, no. Oh, I don't- you may not have been here, so, um, at one point, Sojiro threw us the keys to the shop and said, I can't stick around every night waiting for you to come back anymore, so since you've been, like, going to school and doing the right thing, I'm gonna leave it to you to lock up the shop, so now we can go out to wherever we want at night. <laughs> I've had some experience. Back in my college days, we went to Yacht for the weekends and have massive parties. Something has been tasting particularly sweet lately. This has been much calmer without Kamashida. Finally, get the chance to deserve. Very strange, sure, but because of him, our volleyball team will be forever scarred. The only real option now is to abandon it completely. So, you want to bring the track team to the forefront and make people forget about the shit with the volleyball team? Again, he's carrying new advice. That would be the rebirth of a team that found themselves the depths of despair. The public will love it. <laughs> the very protagonist of my very own tearjerker. All the praise for receiving them will go to me, their incredible loving advisor. <coughs> oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, it's really scummy. A published book skin mode. Oh my god. Okay, you're not gonna become a fucking saint, alright? Jesus Christ. Heard that Nakaoka kid is especially bad. I've already taken care of him. The new cat. Oh, this motherfucker. Subtly, of course. That worked perfectly. But his mother's the president of the PTA. Oh my God! Damn it! Yeah, that's really scummy. Holy shit. Yeah, like he, he, like we basically have Kamashita 2.0. You were very correct, Ryuji. Uh. Let's talk to the Keishi. Hey. <coughs> At least it's Britain. You're just looking out for your own time. That's why I never thought about asking people for help or trying to help our farms together. Yeah. Well, yeah, I mean, you're still a team. <laughs> I think it's cool, Ryuji. I think you're awesome! I, yeah. Seven. Chance to instantly win a battle after what? Excuse me. This has gotten to ridiculous proportions. 
Excuse me. What is this shit? Why and how? Oh my god. <laughs> All right. Wait. It only works on a, things that are a certain number of levels lower than you. I assume so. Like, obviously, I'm not gonna run into like some big bad enemy and have him insta killed. Like, it makes sense. <laughs> yeah, you might as well enjoy the place <laughs> while you're there. Thieves should be arrested. I should write something. I need to my allergy pill. It's about that time, guys. So let's talk. Let's. I, I want to come up with a fun chatting. So, do you guys? Do you guys drink soda? Here's a topic. A random topic. And if so, what do you drink? I was at CVS today. I had to pick up some more allergy medication, and um, they had some cans of ginger ale on sale. So I picked some up because I enjoy ginger ale. I enjoy lots of sodas. Ginger ale's up there. What sodas do you guys like? Do you drink soda at all? What What, what do you like to drink? I mostly just drink water, but soda is one of those habits that's really hard to break. Hard to break. Okay, we're gonna hang with on. On. Be honest. But it. Shh. <laughs> God, I'm terrible. Why? Can you just please? Can you please follow me here on Twitch so that you can then unfollow me for that? Because that's kind of deserved. Well, let's go see her. Hey! Aw, oh, Duck Family! Mr. GMO Gamer lives right off of the water nearby him. And, uh,. We often see duckies inside. I've spent- I've actually spent many a summer night at his place sitting on the dock feeding duckies. Ducks are adorable! Hey! Yep! He lives right off of a canal. Uh, yeah, Hurricane Sandy did not treat him very well. Tons of stories that there are still duck filled parks here, too. Um, I'll say, I know what you mean. Yeah, that's right. I don't know where kind of place we lived in before, but. Hey. Those houses near the water, though, have like stuff equipped for it. Like, they have like water pumps and stuff built into the house. His water pump broke during Sandy. That's why he got, like, super fucked. Um, yeah, it's so crowded and everyone walks really fast. Almost like they're angry or something. Wow, are, are we in New York? <laughs> Even in school, I mean, the foreigner. Nobody really knew me. They just spread rumors. Yeah. No, I like your hair. Don't dye it. It was tough. Takamaki son, your paintings suck. <laughs> I say that's hilarious. <laughs> According to her, they were so bad she just had to tell me. <laughs> Aww. I hope she was doing well. Else I need to, need to talk hey. to her. The female thief in the anime you used to watch? Okay. It's gonna knock my socks off. Huh? Um. You just 
physical thing is actually even more OP and real, and that is why I was level 99 in Endgame. <laughs> oh, Ryuji. Is that just a Ryuji thing? I, I I guess like when you get up to high levels, each character has their. It makes sense because like the lower levels, everybody has the same thing. Like you know, they may let you renegotiate, but it's interesting if they have like individual things for each character when you get towards the end of their uh... confidant. And that's what I'm gonna try and learn from them. I say, good idea. What have you decided? Yes! You're gonna star in action movies! Yeah, good good luck with that. I'm gonna make this my ultimate goal for the future. Thanks! Oh. You wanna be an actress, alright. Actress, model. Why not? Alright. sit-ups a lot <laughs> yeah go ahead if you want gym oh, yeah. advice for you G's actually the guy to ask come on let's head home let's jog to the station she's like let's just do it ah you're back let's do it I am indeed We're hanging out with Kawakami again. I guess I have a feeling that the game, like that, like this walkthrough is gonna make me try to bang out this Kawakami thing as fast as oh. possible. Cause there's lots of stuff you can do at night. Hi. I'm studying no such stuff up just cause you're doing exams. Yes, ma'am. Hey. Let's call her. She's like, can you clean before I come over so I can clean less? <laughs> Yo! Um, the version I'm playing for you just ability will occasionally just end a shadow without a battle when you ambush it. And then you get a persona. In Royal, the ability gives you the, all the experience, money, and items you would have gotten for doing the battle normally, as well as a persona. Interesting. Probably because a lot of people complain about that. I would imagine people getting annoyed by that. Like you go to, like you go to, uh, to level, to like grind and Ryuji just like keeps ending battles and you're not getting any experience and then you have to sub him out of your party. I love cleaning chef sophisticated rooms like this. Is it pain your heart to see such a cute maid all dirty? I'll say it does. So painful. <laughs> your heart is so clean. She's just like, she, I think it's adorable that she's doing this because, um, it feels like even though obviously they have this weird arrangement, like she still wants to legitimately earn her pay, which I feel like says a lot about her. It does kind of feel a little wrong, huh? Shabby chic though. Now cleaning is complete. I have to rush to my part-time job after class ends. I have to prepare for quizzes and homework assignments. And today I had to clean bathtubs and walk dogs before coming here. Oh my god, how many jobs do you have, lady? You didn't do anything to me, me, were you? I can't say I wasn't. What? No. Absolutely not. I would never. As long as you understand. <laughs> I know I'm in a maid outfit, but I'm still your teacher. Of course. I'm gonna all of my students. Maybe ten. <laughs> I'm 
for the maid service. Uh, you really need the money that badly? You know. Oh, we're about to have a sad story, guys. She's. Oh no. Oh, sadness. Well, you know, if he were an adult, there would be a lot more involved in it, so... What? <coughs> Wrong number. What? I mean, I kinda do, but I'm pretty sure this is not what I need the 100,000 yen for. Um, all of this is all for you. Am I actually giving it to her? Okay, no I'm not, but I'm just saying that I'm doing it for her. You're supposed to be your high school joy, yes. All right. <sighs> okay. I feel so bad for her. She must never have a moment to herself. Um, I, I believe, I believe it's junior year. I believe it's junior year. Oh, I don't remember. All right, we're gonna accept this invitation. <coughs> The cake night rises. What the fuck? Is it like the dark night rises except it's a cake? Instead of Batman, is it the big man? That was terrible. Please make sure to follow me so you can unfollow me again. Um. I will commit. Like you, Japanese high school, so pretty much junior 11th grade. Yeah, so he's like 16, 17, somewhere around there. <laughs> Sorry. Just enough for these romances to be kind of okay, right, Japan? <laughs> Do you want to know why? I use pies. Cakes are too quick. You can't savor all the little taste sensations. You see, when forced to choose cake or pie, people show you their true taste. I am nothing like you. You're a psychopath who bakes for money. <laughs> what the fuck? What level of shenanigans? Morgana! <laughs> Morgana's like, um... This is stupid. <laughs> oh, we're learning kindness, huh? Alright. Actually... Uh, yeah, they do. It makes you reminds right? me of being a phantom thief. I'll pay you back for that. Yeah, it was fun. There's friendship involved. 
Ah, you're back. So it doesn't appear to be a thing either. All he said to me is, I'm sorry. For sure, we'll be fine. <laughs> oh yeah, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to check out the TV, aren't we, and buy something ridiculous. And the scenes are hilarious. They might be worth seeing, even if you reload and redo the day. I will keep that in mind. If something pops up and it looks like it might be fun, I'll definitely maybe do it and reload. That's something that I should keep in mind. Thank you, Tress. Right. What do we got? The wild claws. Why the fuck are we buying claws? Are we gonna get fucking, you know, Uggs next week. <laughs> Mild clogs. Resist fear. Might be interesting. Gonna be 1980? Oh, wow, that's, that's a little pricier. A pack of murder hornets fresh from the source. Oh no! Murder hornets! I feel like the song did change again. Right. We're not gonna go. Drink one of those disgusting drinks. I'd be down for some murder hornets that would just bees. Welcome. It's an onsen, Algiru. Okay. Well, we are not in an onsen. I'll tell you that much. with uh, this guy. become a politician because saying so will increase my confidant with you um i want to improve my speech <laughs> politician. what kind of politician do i want to be uh one with conviction you're right sure give me some advice to politics, you must possess a central philosophy. What is it that you want to accomplish? Uh, that was helpful. Thank you. Very well. Yeah, I can tell that's your philosophy. Oh. <laughs> <coughs> 
Maybe it'll help me negotiate. Yeah, what did I say? What were the words that just came out of my mouth? Occasionally ask for more money or items during negotiation. All right. Ooh, ho. Yeah, I love it. He's just standing there like, oh my god, when will he stop? I'm hiding behind the side so nobody sees my face. <laughs> Wow, that was that was a like a switch flip, dude. Okay, so it's increased my charm. That's a big charm increase. All right. I shall ask you again another time. Almost at the end of this month. You know what that means? We're gonna start getting cool summer outfits soon for school! Ooh, we're over. Oh, we're, oh, we, we hit 8%. Ooh. Ooh, we're getting there. More people want to know. Um, hey. uh, we're going to finish Alluring Dancer. Hmm? Wow. Even when facing death, her soul is free. Oh. I suppose life without freedom is pointless. Hmm. We did learn a lot. Getting all those charm points. All right. get so seasick I can't go on boats it's so bad not that I, I don't care about boats anyway I don't want to be on boats I, I don't like boats yes what is the answer who is the pirate who said that he hid his treasure in a certain place just before he was executed I'm gonna take a, ch a, a, a chance at it because we seem to be a asking questions about our personas and say it's William Kidd how did I know very good. From should have been subdued price, but in order to turn his commission into a property, he ended up becoming a pirate himself. Nice going. All right. This is first exposed was such as the aristocracy himself was considered rich. Island in Kyushu where kids treasure is so to sleep. Yep. So value in letting that many people dream about it. Sure. Mm. It's raining. I should write something. It's raining! Alright, we're gonna go to the Shibuya Diner, apparently. We watched a documentary about Captain Kid's treasure and how he screw how, how screwed over he got. Now I'm kind of actually interested. That's why we're here, because it's raining, so we can get a knowledge up, which is great since it fairly takes 5,000 years to get a knowledge rank up. Oh! Um. I want a hot coffee today. That's what makes me gutsy, is that I just ordered a coffee and then stayed. All right. Hey! <laughs> All right. Nice. Got an extra point because it's raining. All right. Wanna head back?
And now we're going to go to the bathhouse. Because uh, we need to bathe. Beautiful. Let's do it. Oh, we should also buy some SP items while we're here. I've kind of been forgetting to do that. I really should do that. Give them to me! Maybe to authorized pirate, but he went the wrong. He went after the wrong ship, and then it's a mark that said authorized. Oh, jeez, that does suck. Sounds like he was set up. Oh. Let's go in. Amazing what dating can do. All right. Wanna head back? <laughs> Morning. What's up, are you G? are so annoying. Yes, they are. Please head to the exam room. I kind of want to see what we have. Yeah. Okay. Which one? I just love how stylish that is. Why do you have such a serious look on your face? Because bots, that's why. Take care. Yeah, that is a lot of medication. That's all for us, baby. It's all healing stuff. He's used to yeah, that's true. There really is no, like, shower where he's housed, huh? Uh-huh. Um. Oh, it's a cami. You're definitely shy. She says your messages are better than those at the big hospitals. Wow, she really likes you, huh? <sighs> Did something happen? It's all your fault. 
Let's head about to be studied by that girl and her dad. Apparently they've been telling everyone I can make all these amazing medicines and remedies. Ah, oh, so a lot of people have been coming to see you, huh? Today a patient requested a sweet smelling compress. It's for a cold buster. A drug like that deserves a Nobel Prize. <laughs> Kind of genius. Sure you are. You are a genius. Look at what you're creating, my dude. Stop that. I'm not interested in... Yeah, I know. You're just trying to fix that one drug. I say it suits you. <gasps> she liked it. Why well, it still can be? All right. Oh. I'm, take a f oh, I'm glad that she's making a full recovery. What? I just had a really bad premonition. I hope this little girl doesn't take like a bad turn and then dies. Oh dear. All right. Bye. We're gonna take the big bang burger challenge tonight, uh, guys. We're gonna we're eat a huge ass burger. To be honest, that sounds delicious right now. I'm kind of hungry. I had a buttered bagel for dinner tonight. <laughs> best bagels to exist, it's true. The best bagels. Alright, we need to go to Big Bang Burger and take the Big Bang Burger challenge. And that must be Big Bang Burger. Over there. Allergies suck. Yep. Give me your challenge. Because there's no day or night in space. Okay. So the Big Bay Challenge, we don't have a special KB tonight. The Big Bay Challenge will cost our trip to travel is a meager fee of only fun. Yeah, I want the Big Bang Challenge. I'm gonna take the challenge. Cause time to pass, but improve your guts. Cost money. The challenge is conquered if you can eat the entire big burger to succeed. You will need knowledge, proficiency, and guts. Prevail, and you will receive a prize and an increase in a stat other than guts. Win or lose, your guts will always increase. All right, here we go, guys. Will we win the challenge? I'll give you guys a couple seconds. Place your bets now. Are we gonna win or are we gonna lose? No way I can win? All right. Thank you very much. Sorry, uh, you'll be starting right will be third me. A comet burger. <sighs> Holy shit, that is gigantic. Now then. 30 minutes to eat all that. Do you think that you could eat a burger that size in 30 minutes? Let me know in the chat or in the comments if you're watching this on YouTube. I want to know, could you eat that burger? Look at everybody staring. Look at this couple next to us is like, <gasps> this is a very American thing. Oh, this meat makes sense for a challenge of such cosmic proportions. I have a proposal. 
think you can have the luxury of enjoying the taste. Just don't chew, just swallow. Yeah, kind of. <sighs> Thank you. Thank you. I am the burger master. I don't know how I fit all that into his scrawny ass body, but okay. Congratulations. What do I get? Second mate badge. Ooh. I wanna know what that is. Please come again. I see. I used to be able to when I took a pill. Diluting your stomach's I'm full response. Hmm. Alright, we got the All gut. Right. No time drinks, it just to be time for me. Everything is perfect. Alright, so what else we get? We got knowledge. All right. We got charm. Alright. And we got proficiency. Right. Wanna head back? Everything but kindness, which honestly kind of makes sense because um, there's really nothing you can learn about kindness from eating a burger, except that you're kind of a pig. <laughs> I'm joking. Good on you if you could eat a burger like that. Jesus Christ, I couldn't. You ever hear of the Heart Attack Grill? Like that place scares me. You're kind to your taste buds, yes. You were kind to your taste buds by eating such delicious food. Sorry. Employee posts a new chef selfie. Wild duck burger claims to a fire deep. Oh, jeez. The police are issued for people who are your scans. Tickets for the Matarama exhibit are available till June 5th. Hmm. Cruel to every other part of your body. Tell me about it. Well then, I'll just add this. It's June first. All right, we are gonna return this book at the biblioteca. And we're going to borrow. The Great Thief. It's about time we read about our actual persona. And we are going to quick travel to the underground mall and hang with on. Because on is cool. Also, we need to level up in the lover's rank. We'll just have to wait for now. Let's chat before you go see Shiho. Thanks. For real? The double cream from that famous crepe shop is half off right now. She loves. Aww. She loves her sweets. They picked into the hospital. Two. Um. Give it up. Hey, <laughs> she's trying to come up with an excuse to get one. I love what I should try to. Oh. She might have rehab today too. They probably need better. Um. This what we have. She pushed it up ahead of schedule. I think it's because I told her about how I want to get stronger. Aw, she's. Aw. So I'm gonna head over Let's go. Okay, we're go we're going to one of her shoots. Sure. Looks like they're having a pre-shoot meeting. So pumped to get to work with you today. Go 
older, but you have loads more experience. This girl comes off as incredibly fake. You're so nice. <laughs> I'm gonna cuff you in half with a hatchet. Uh, can you teach me how to be a better model? Your everyday routine stretches. Mm -hmm. Uh-oh. Is this gonna be one of those things where she's just like, I don't know, I'm just myself. I'm place to import some organic green almonds. Unless I'm getting super tired of eating quinoa. Do I need to, like, boil it? Mm hmm? I eat those when they're covered in chocolate. Do you weigh yourself? It's a year for... <laughs> She's not self-conscious at all, like, she- she's not that typical model, I guess. care about mom. Oh, this bitch. Wait! We had both of you be check out how to substitute for missing mom. We wanted both of you on the cover, but if you're... Yo, I knew it! This bitch, look at that! What? Oh. Wow. Jesus Christ. You didn't screw it up, she did. She's un- that woman was unreal. Jesus Christ. Actually, that invested in my Uh, it had grace. Do you think- That's what you're missing. I know the perfect technique. Tell me, tell me your perfect technique. He is, you don't actually cry. That's why it's fake. Yes! I'll turn my failure today into positive energy going forward. Okay. Crocodile tears! Chance to force enemies to ask for less during negotiations. All right. Also, like, if they take her captive, she can be like, Please don't hurt me! And they'll ask for less. Incredible. Thanks! You're welcome. Bye! We haven't seen anybody get uh, taken captive except for that one time that we were learned about it. I haven't seen that yet. It'll happen at some point, I'm sure. Ah, you're back. This is what be any soon, that's right. Pretty much. So it's just to tell whether or not the house has got to be the yes, but yeah. Yeah. Let's do it. We would have ended up attacking the woman. Alright. We need 
need to speak to the customers to make them leave so that we can read. Yeah, I guess it's more people doing weird shit. Yes, we want to read The Great Thief. Make sure you close up. Yes, sir. Mm. Oh, I said he's prominent in our field. Yeah, well, that's my persona. Hey, hey! Not quite yet. Makoto, you're back again. That Great. reminds me. <laughs> Why did Mr. Kamashita change all of a sudden? Um. I'll say, uh. I don't want to say I'm not interested because that's bullshit. He was about to expel me. You know what I mean? I would say, I guess he grew a conscience. Hmm. This is it's still too simple. I believe it only natural that the game should cause it. Uh, one of my biggest pet peeves in the world is somebody accusing me of something I didn't do. That that oh. will take me from zero to a hundred real fucking quick. Let's do it. That gets me really pissed off. Alright, we're gonna go to the bookstore in Shibuya, or Central Street. That's right. And we're gonna buy two books. We have a lot of- I guess we're gonna eventually have time to read all these. Welcome. And we are going to buy Tidying the Heart. Is, I guess gonna teach us proficiency and playing the game. Which will teach us No, she's not! Oh, come on, Makoto! Is this what you wanted me to see if I look behind myself? Is she following me everywhere? <laughs> oh my god, wait. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, come on, follow me, follow me, keep doing it. <laughs> I can go up and talk to her too. Oh my god, I'm gonna go up and talk to her. I'm gonna be like, hey, fancy seeing you here. Um, I'm tired of simply wondering. And she's gonna keep on following me. Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> That's so good! I just... I saw her standing outside the shop out of the corner of my eye and I was like, is that Maka- Is she- Is she, is she following me? <laughs> it's so good! I love this game. <sighs> Alright, well we're gonna go somewhere she's not gonna want to follow us to and that's the air shop. Air soft shop. Blech. I don't have the guts Come yet. On. I'm sorry. We're gonna sell okay. all of our treasure. You should be grateful. And it says to not buy anything, but all right. I feel like Yusuke is kind of behind in the game. I should probably wait though. Uh, come again. Don't tell me this old place. For kids. She'll do it at school too. I got. I gotta. I gotta go find her at school too. Next time at school, I'm gonna go wander around. I totally forgot to look behind me. So we need three silk yarn and tin clasp. Let me. Eight, four. 
Cool, we have enough. So now we're gonna go work at the flower shop. She gonna do it here? Nah, she's not here. from a case in which he said I'd like you to pick out the flowers. I'll vary your pay based on how pleased the customers are with what you choose. And if you get stuck, I suggest you study up at the flower Next. media. Okay. I'm counting on you. For large, brightly colored flowers. Pick three that fit that description. Okay. Large, brightly colored flowers. Alright. Large and red is good. A gold gerbera. A large pink, a gecko orchid. Okay, so there's a couple that work, but I have a list here of specific ones that I need to pick. Chrysanthemum, Gold Jabera, and the Scarlet Rose. What do you want to do? I think yellow, red, and white would go good together. There's an anime about people who are All right. flower forests by We're day and back. assassins by night. It's called Vice Kreutz, and it's not nearly as good as this game. <laughs> but it is good for a laugh. The main character, um, uh, who is a good guy, is voiced by um, Kurosawa Takahito, who plays Dio in JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. He also took the main voice actors from that show, he created that show, and then he took the main voice actors and started a band with them, where he sang songs dressed up as those characters from that show. And, um, he's a pretty interesting guy. I don't know what prompted me to talk about that. I'm dumb! Let's do the TV show! Ask me a question. We're talking about juvenile crap, you have to hear- Yes, I wouldn't know anything about getting in legal trouble. When it comes to probation, um, overseas travel is prohibited, right? No, pr probation officers are unpaid. Really? He's not real. Oh, I guess he is my probation officer in a All way. Right. Uh, it's a very common anime thing for um, voice actors to then sing songs for the show. It's very common. Yeah, I think it's only a Japanese thing. I don't think I'm, I don't think you could get an American to do anything unless you give them money for it. Let's be honest. All right, I'm gonna go to the bathhouse. Okay, still sit down. 
I forgot how when the last time was that I bought one. I'm sorry. Super fly. All right. Want to head back? Oh, we're getting we're getting close to nine percent. Viral marketing, kind of. Hey. Okay, we're gonna need the great thief. Yo, Critical Role's a pretty Hi. cool group. I tried getting into their show, but it's got it's been going on for so long and the episodes are so long that I just don't have the time to catch up. But um they basically created a D&D &D renaissance, man. Instead of regular class, we'll be reading last week's materials. I suggest you listen carefully, but don't think you can slack off. I absolutely won't allow no slacking off. Hmm. Hmm. Ooh, she's giving us a chance. We'll be able to slack off on class in certain days. We can craft infiltration tools. I'm just gonna make a lock pick right in the middle of fucking class. So what we're gonna to read a book. Playing the game. Smoke it just irritates me. Hey, hey! Yeah, didn't get full. Hope we take it. No, halfway there. You got it! People in Critical Role are really nice right too. Side. I've met Laura Bailey a couple of times. She's a fucking angel, that lady. Alright, we're gonna go hang out with Takemi. This is nearly complete. Let's do it. Hub Matador. It's a milestone. Ooh. I suppose. Did enjoy an apple? It's a gift for one of my elderly patients. She gave you a lot. <laughs> oh shit! It's the chief. Doesn't look like a patient. Oh. He's in the examination room, sitting on the bed. What makes him not look like a patient? One of my patients, a girlfriend, had this. <sighs> Yeah, the university house was inferior to that of a general practitioner. Original medicine. Yeah, well, I mean, you're not helping her, so suck a butt. Uh, this is harassment, my dude. You you heard the <laughs> words that came out of my mouth. You heard them loud and clear. Identity. Torture the patient with unregulated medicine. What does this mean?
I told you that little girl was gonna die. <laughs> oh no, this is the this is the original one that she lost her thing over. Okay. No. Yeah, she was trying to find the cure for her. Yeah, let's ask for details, because uh, we have no proof of this, and this guy seems like enough of a jerk to lie about it. Yeah, exactly, coins. Exactly. I agree with you. Need a point. Yeah, just don't worry about it. Sorry. It's still so creepy that she calls me that. Ooh, we get a discount. Right. We get a discount. I don't know what to say. So me, uh, we all do sometimes. <laughs> and we get our guts increase. All right. Take care. Now we can buy that SP adhesive for only 50,000 yen. I'm interested to see what it does. We have to check that out sometime. Ah, you're back. And we're gonna call Kawakami. I'll just add this. Well, I don't think we have a persona that works with her, so I think we're gonna oh. wind up just passing time. But we gotta Hi. do it. Oh, we're fine. Hey! Yeah, it won't deepen just yet, that's fine. We're working towards it. Where have you been? Then I'll head over! Searching all along. You're facing twilight no without her. She seemed to be thankful that I requested her. Yeah, well. <coughs> she gets paid. Thank you for using our service. He's got a pretty sweet setup here. He's got a teacher wrapped around his finger. Oh, no. Oh my god, this woman is unbelievable. Uh, this is my least favorite month. It takes an hour to do my hair with the human thing. Yes, ma'am. Question. The original blazers were named specific policy they had one here. Blazers? They were brightly colored? I don't know about fire patterns. They were brightly colored! Okay. Excellent. Nice going. All right. He's gonna capitalizing on a bad hand. This is not color at all. I think black is stylish too. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna go this. to the clinic and buy some of that SP adhesive. Apparently, apparently it's very important, muy importante. So let's do it. There's no one here. Please head to the exam room. I 
I see. Oh, is it an accessory? It is. An adhesive that gradually restore. Try not to suffer any unnecessary injuries. I want the data I collect from you to be of use. You did probably didn't hear that. I wanted to do that bit, but I'm gonna wind up fucking up. I feel up like you have a different vibe going on. What? Fought though? Okay. Why do you have such a serious look on your face? Buy some SP adhesive 3 if you can and equip them. What is some? It's exceptionally effective. Thanks. This will work well. Here you go. I guess I'll buy two of them? Take care. I don't know what sum is, but I got two of them. I feel like that's something I would want for the whole party, though. Hmm. Let me buy two more. I have Please all of this yet, and I might as well abuse the fact that I'm on an easy mode. You want a shot? It's no, I don't. Exceptionally effective. Oh, here you go. Take care. Let's see. Strength plus two. Oh yeah, invigorate. Yes, that's an that's an old thing. SP adhesive. We all get SP adhesives. That's really nice. Holy shit, are SP adhesives nice. Well, on, I don't really care about because I think I'm gonna leave her out of this. Speed heat lives in the new fun times. We're gonna go buy some bio nutrients. You're kidding, right? Well, Aunt does have healing capabilities, but I'm mostly using her when she's not in the uh when she's not in the the um the party, so the SP adhesive's not really gonna help her. Give me some bio nutrients, bitch! No way, seriously? We're gonna go hang out with On. Is he getting bored? Have you heard? We'll just have to wait for now. Oh, yeah! I'm gonna go to Shibuya. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh yeah, so she'll want to go to the buffet, that's for sure. Okay, let's get going. Operation eat a bit of everything. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, honestly. Yeah, I won't make the same mistake again. In before she makes the same mistake. Yes. Seriously? <laughs> a million customers. Wow. They gave you a chocolate fountain? I'll take it. Thanks. <laughs> ah, you're back. Yep. Hmm. 
Monorami's on the phone. Oh, geez. With who? Can we tell? Alrighty, tomorrow's the day, Let's Queen do it. of the Queens. Alright, we're gonna go hang out with Kawakami again. Oh. And then once we find out what happens tomorrow, I think I'm gonna end for the night. Hi. Yes, it's me. Hey. Come on over, baby cakes. Made cup of noodles, huh? Uh, yeah, they do make a big difference. <laughs> what am I to leave the sauce back in the mood so it gets warm? Sweet, yeah. Um, I wanted to see you. Yeah, you are making money from it. I'm just trying to help. Jeez. <laughs> uh oh. They can't agree on what to do, huh? I'll just request you more often, it's fine. Pay you under the table? Is her sister Miwa Chan? Well, considering that Miwa Chan is apparently dead, I don't know. Alright. Oh, she can't do laundry for us! I don't know if I trust her to make coffee, but. You know, Sojo would probably get real butthurt about it. Yeah, apparently dead. Uh oh, here he goes. What's up with that old geezer? Oh, is he crying? Ooh. I, I have committed crimes that are unbecoming of an artist. Ooh. Plainly put, I. Plagiarized work. I, I tainted this, this country's art world, and, and even Sayuri. How could I, I possibly apologize to, to everyone for, for what I've done? <laughs> A little over dramatic, but I'll take it. <laughs> He's crying way too much. <laughs> And that was from the urgent apology conference by Matarame that took place just a moment ago. After reporting to the association, Matarame has agreed to the police's request to turn himself in. Wasn't he on TV the other day? 
On top of charges of abuse to his pupils, Matarame is under suspicion of claiming their works as his own. Some doubt the validity that his maiden work, Sayuri, was stolen, believing it was used for fraud. This large-scale criminal act has caused a great shock to the art world, and... That old man's done for. Nope, no sympathy. After the conference, Matarame was taken to a police hospital for interrogation due to his age. However, initial psych evaluations state that he is mentally sound and likely responsible for his actions. There's no need to be nice to an old geezer like that. Why do he spill the beans himself? Doesn't that seem weird? Also, a group calling themselves the Phantom Thieves posted a dupious note at Matarame's account. And here it comes! The police will investigate their relation to this case, but for now, did not identify them as suspects. So now the police are involved in trying to figure out who we are. This isn't gonna spiral out of control real quick. <laughs> Phantom Thieves? Do these bandits have something to do with that old geezer's apology? Oh, I've heard of them before. They supposedly steal evil hearts. It's why the culprits apologize. Wait, what? Steal hearts? <laughs> That's impossible, though. But I feel like I saw something about that online, too. They sent out a calling card for real. Oh, so it was like, we're going to take your heart? Oh, that's impressive if someone really did that. Phantom thieves, huh? Oh, you're not gonna become a problem. Whoever the fuck you are, you're not gonna become a problem. Phantom thieves again. And you're already a problem. More people keep getting involved, man. Maybe maybe that guy's our th the next person we're gonna help. I don't know. Did you guys see the news about Matarame? It's just like what happened with Kamoshida. And they mentioned the Phantom Thieves. Man, this is starting to get interesting. If we do it right, we can change people's hearts. With this power, we might be able to do more than just getting back at society. It'll be a big deal. Yeah, this would be fun. Let's keep pushing on then. As for me, I hope we just keep getting more and more famous. <coughs> yeah, cause that, that's the point of it all. Something like this happening twice is massive too. It's too great a coincidence to occur normally. If we continue doing this, we'll definitely be able to give courage to everyone who needs it. It's, uh, it's on the track to spiral out of control. Here we, we go. to quiet down a little. Do you know them? You moron! Those are attendance officers! Hello there. May I speak with you for a moment? Ah, yes! How can we help you? That monotonous acting of hers never fails to send a chill down my spine. <laughs> it's pretty bad. <laughs> what are you all doing here? Are you friends? Um... Doesn't seem to be bad. <laughs> We're delinquents. What do we look like, man? Hmm. What did you say? Uh, <laughs> that was a joke. <laughs> he didn't get much sleep last night. Well, all right. Just make sure you disperse before it gets too late, okay? There have been some odd happenings lately, and the news about that artist has caused quite the stir. We'll be careful. The light out. Man, those guys must have way too much time on their hands. Hey, don't go making stuff up on the spot like that, okay? I totally panicked because of you. From now on, we'll need to be even more cautious than before. Look at us. Right after the second Thebes incident, both prior victims are meeting up. Yeah. Wait, you mean people might be listening to us? I mean, if people in the school realize, you know, obviously the people in our school know the three of us were wrapped up in the Kamashita shit, and then they find us hanging out with Yusuke, and they realize Yusuke was Madarami's pupil. It'll be fine. Look around, we're the only people worrying about it. I guess you're right. By the way, Yusuke, you able to get anything out of Madarame? Remember how he was talking about that suspicious person in the black mask? Well, I pressed him for answers, but he doesn't even understand what happened to him to begin with. It's not like he actually saw his desires get stolen, after all. 
It's rumored that he may be sent to prison. In that case, gaining information will be difficult. So, what are you gonna do now? I'll be leaving that house. I can't draw on such <coughs> place anymore. Do you have somewhere to go? The school dorms. I can stay there free of charge thanks to my fine arts scholarship. Okay. A scholarship? Wait, you're that good? Although, Takamaki-san's house would do as well. All right, Wait, buddy! What? You know, you could ask her to model for you whenever you wanted. You moron! Then again, now that Yusuke will be living alone, it'll be easier for us to meet up whenever we want. For the time being, we should wait and see how this case plays out. And it'll probably take some time for him to target as big as Madarame. Anyway, we should just act like normal students while we look for our next target, okay? We'll be entrusting that to you again, Ryuji. Alright, guess it's just more prep till then. Yusuke Kitagawa. Because we're not supposed to realize she's stalking us. <coughs> so after Shiho Suzui, you did it again for someone you barely knew? You were sent away twice, almost reported to the police, and yet you still wanted to save him. Moreover, you ended up in a museum instead of a castle this time. You're still going to maintain this rubbish about changing someone's heart by stealing their treasure? It ain't rubbish, bitch. It's all true. Hmm. <laughs> Very well. The truth behind this tale of yours will be clear once your conspirators are in custody. Now then, tell me about this new member who joined your group. There's no point in being stubborn. It will only damage your position. The identity of Madarame's pupil can be easily discovered with a little investigation. Snitches get stitches, bitch. So you won't sell out your accomplice? <laughs> no! But I look like an idiot! <laughs> Fine. There's still much more that I want to hear. It was around this time that the Phantom Thieves began to truly gain popularity. Lies flooded the internet. Things like the Phantom Thieves saved me too, or I got a calling card. For heaven's sake, those lies made the collection of intel take almost ten times longer. Mm. Now your next target was this man. Who the fuck is that? Junya Kaneshiro. He doesn't compare to the previous two. Even the police had been struggling to apprehend him. Oh, okay, so he's a criminal. So, exactly how did you take down such a well-guarded criminal? Tell me. Sorry, if my head's tilting, it's because I'm looking at the... The picture, which is skewed. The suspect has repeatedly testified that he does not have any recollection of his actions. A full psychiatric evaluation will be performed to further investigate the crime's details and motives. First Kamoshida at Shujin Academy, and now Madarame. I found a number of points of commonality between the two. Both, for example, were sent a calling card before their unforeseen changes of heart. I see. But isn't tying their cases to the series of psychotic breakdowns jumping to conclusions? Furthermore, yeah, a little the bit. police will frown upon you stepping into this. Now isn't the time to be worrying about things like jurisdiction and honor. We need to dig deeper and find a correlation among the incidents these past two, three years. <sighs> Very well, I leave it to you. However, you must not let this interfere with your regular duties. Thank you, sir. That damn woman just had to stop. I don't know about no jurisdiction, no case. I mean, I get why she means no jurisdiction. If you can help, just fucking help. And I understand that these abnormal incidents have caused some anxiety throughout our country. 
This situation must be approached with the utmost seriousness. Oh, you have to be shitting me! Oh my god! Do they mean ruling party member as in like a member of the government? Who the fuck did we fucking assault in that alleyway? Jesus Christ! I shall continue to put forth great effort so that every citizen can live with peace of mind. What the fuck? Not only are there these phantom thieves to worry about, but if that is exposed... <sighs> Uh-oh, what is that? Exaggerating, my dude. Yeah, we're friends, my dude. Let's do it. Alright, so I'm gonna save here, and that's gonna be the end of Hold Tonight, Queens. And I don't think that she was talking about, um, like, a legal form of jurisdiction. I, because he wasn't talking about the law, he was just like, the police are gonna get pissed if you step on a case that they're already working on, and she's just like, fuck the fact that they're already working on it, if I can help, I should help. Like, I think that's what she meant by jurisdiction. Like, she does, like, he's like, don't bruise their egos, and she's like, fuck their egos, like, we need to figure out what's going on, you know what I mean? At least that's how I took it. Yeah, that, that SIU director is definitely shady, and it looks like that guy is a politician, which is, dear lord in heaven. Anyway, <laughs> thank you guys so much for hanging out with me tonight. I so appreciate it. I am totally excited to join you guys tomorrow at 7 p.m. Eastern for more Persona 5 goodness. Until then, thank you so much for hanging out with me, and I will see you all very soon. Have a lovely evening.